New uh, clinical trial for Alzheimer's treatment is starting soon in Albany. News and ABC's Michaela Singleton speaking today with local office and it's going to be at the forefront of this new research. Over the last five years, Jim Manuel has slowly started to lose bits and pieces of his life. Pieces so small, it was easy for his wife and kids to think he was imagining it. There are just parts I don't remember as clear and I don't trust my memory as much. But he says it's hard to ignore his family history. He lost both his parents and grandparents to dementia. Terrifying. You know, uh, I feel like I know what's going to happen if I do nothing. So therefore, it is so critically important that I do something. Manuel is now a patient at Neurological Associates of Albany, a local Alzheimer's research and treatment center. Dr. Richard Holub says his office will be one of only 46 in the nation, participating in a new phase three clinical trial for Lift AD. That therapy by Athera Pharma is able to penetrate the wall protecting the brain called the blood brain barrier. They developed a small molecule which can be uh, delivered by uh, an insulin like syringe. Holub says this treatment option represents a new wave of Alzheimer's research targeting these small early contributors to the disease, hopefully preventing cognitive decline before it starts. It initiates a cascade of events that are positive, uh, uh, so uh, that it, it's neuroprotective, neurorestorative. It reduces inflammation by, by one way. By another way, it improves blood flow. Until 2021, the FDA had not approved a new Alzheimer's treatment in more than 15 years. Dr. Holub says the lift ad trial is one of many now surfacing thanks to new understanding of the brain just in the last year or two there's a certain optimism a certain sense that we're going to get there the first patient the first patient to be cured of alzheimer's is out there right now so uh, I mean, whether it's me or someone else, that is energizing. Reporting in Albany, Michaela Singleton, News 10 ABC. We wish him the best. And that's why we have to be so grateful to him and to everyone yeah. else in clinical trials like mm -hmm. this.